welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new so in today's video i'm going to be doing a 16th birthday wish list so my birthday is the 31st of october and i am turning 16 obviously and today is today is the 17th of september so this video is going up quite early and i'm pretty sure i'm uploading this on the 18th and also this is an extra video i do usually upload every single wednesday at 5 15 pm uk time but sometimes i will do an extra video as i said and this is obviously an extra little video so i just wanted to do a quick little disclaimer i just wanted to say that by making this video i'm not saying that i'm gonna get everything i know i'm not gonna get everything on this list because I wrote a lot of things on this list and a lot of the things I wrote are quite pricey so I know I'm not going to get all of this. I'll be lucky to get even a quarter of this because I've got so much on my list and I will be grateful for everything I get for my birthday as I always am every year and a few people have already asked me what I want for my birthday so I thought I would make this and then if anyone asked me I could send it to them. Even if it's not something that I put in this video they could get ideas from what I said and then they could apply that to get me something if they want to this list is mainly just for my mum if I'm honest because she is the one who gets me like the main presents I did do a 15th birthday haul but it's so bad I don't recommend watching it but it is still on my channel if you want to go and watch it I don't know if you can see this because of the lighting but I've got a list right here and I'm gonna try and put a photo there I've moved to this side so I can put a photo there of everything in case I can't describe things properly so I'm just gonna start from the top of the list so the first thing on my birthday list is something that I know I'm not gonna get I'm not expecting this at all but I'm still putting it on my list because you never know um, and that is an iPad and if I were to get one then a case to go with it even though I know I'm not but I would absolutely love an iPad because I did used to have one but it's old now and the camera is really bad and I want it mainly for YouTube because I want it for YouTube and school. I don't really mind what iPad it is, even if it's like the sixth generation, just one that has a good camera. And even if it's an iPad mini, I don't really mind, just as long as it has a good camera so I can do my videos on. So if you didn't know, I do do my videos on my phone and I have the iPhone 8 Plus. And just the thing is my storage is a bit low, so it's hard for me to make videos, but I think if I had an iPad, it would be easier and storage wouldn't be an issue. An iPad's an iPad, as long as it has a good camera I don't really care but I would absolutely love a gold one or a rose gold one. The second thing on my list is the Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. I absolutely love this palette. I've swatched it so many times in the shop and I just want it so badly. It's mainly filled with oranges and reds with a couple of browns. It's just such a nice palette and I think it's definitely worth every penny. And if you haven't watched my makeup collection or even any of my videos, you will know that I absolutely love the Naked palettes. I have four of them i have the naked cherry palette i have the naked three palette i have the naked two palette and i have the naked one palette the next thing on my list is the Too faced born this way foundation there's nothing really much to say about it it's just a foundation um i do have the Too faced peach perfect foundation but i feel like that's a bit more of a springtime foundation the next thing on my list is the Too faced chocolate bonbon palette it's such a nice palette the packaging is so nice i absolutely love it and i do have two of the Too faced like chocolate bar style palettes and i absolutely love Too faced they are my all-time favorite makeup brand as you can probably tell if you watch my videos the next thing on my list is again from Too faced and it's just the Too faced hangover primer i do have a dupe for it which is the iheart revolution coconut dream primer and i think that is such a good primer and i absolutely love it and I would really like the Too Faced one because it's bigger and I think it's better value for money. Although it costs a lot more money, I don't need to keep rebuying it like I do have to with the iHeart Revolution one. So that's all the makeup on my list. The next thing I would like for my birthday is the Christmas pyjamas. Any Christmas pyjamas, I just love Christmas pyjamas. If you know, well I don't think I've actually said it on my channel but if you know me in real life, you know I love Christmas. Like in July I'll be like, oh my god it's Christmas in seven months is it? august september october november december no so if you know me even in july i'll be like oh my gosh it's christmas in five months i'm just obsessed with christmas and now all my viewers know too i absolutely love christmas so i would love some christmas pajamas the next thing i'm not expecting again because i know it's really expensive but i would absolutely love it so i put it on my list and it's the i need to read it out because it's so long it's the dr martin's vegan 1460 vegan pattern ankle boots it says vegan in it twice i would love dr martin's but obviously the faux ones and i did go to the dr martin shop in stratford westfield and i saw them in there like i saw the exact ones i want and they are i'm pretty they're quite expensive so i'm not expecting it but i would absolutely love it so the next thing on my list is 
some shoes again and it's like no particular shoes it's just girly trainers because I love trainers I live in them and I obviously like girly type of shoes I'll put a few photos on the screen of what I mean by girly trainers but I like the colors pink black and white and maybe nude nude doesn't go the best with my skin color so black pink and white and I think out of all the colors I prefer black because I don't have any black trainers so the next thing again is very expensive and it's the HP sprocket and this isn't something at the top of my list something I would like but it's not like oh my gosh I want it more than I want anything else it is the HP sprocket and you can just connect it to your phone and then you can print photos from your phone and I think it would be so nice to make a photo wall but if I don't get that and until I do eventually get one I will be going to the printer shop to print photos which I don't mind at all but it will just be nice to be able to do it myself. The next thing is something that I really want like if this is probably like the top five things I want and it is a ring light I don't mind if it's small big cheap any just a ring light for my room because I have to always make sure I'm filming at a good time to get good lighting as you can tell it's not very good lighting right now but I really would like a ring light just so I can use it to help me with my videos and to make the quality and lighting a bit better so the next thing is a tripod and it's I would like a tripod that you can use for a phone and iPad so not so like you can extend it so it can be iPad size and phone size so that if I did get an iPad eventually even if it's not my birthday if I did eventually get one I wouldn't have to rebuy a tripod I did have a phone tripod but I broke it because my phone was too heavy and it just snapped it but at the moment I literally balance my phone on perfumes that is literally what I'm balancing my phone on right now so the next thing is phone cases you um it's kind of obvious the type of phone cases I like pink silver gold rose gold gray just nice colors like that and like quite girly phone cases and I do have the iPhone 8 plus if you're wondering the size of my phone the next thing I'm pretty sure it's called a light box like one of them things that you can insert letters like it lights up and you can change the letters around I think it would look really good there on my table in the background of my videos I just love it and I would love one so much the next thing is the thing I want for my birthday more than anything else I would love the Carla K.A.T. ukulele so I do actually have three ukuleles but one of them is a soprano one is a concert and one is a baritone and the K.A.T. ukulele is is a tenor ukulele so it's Carla tenor that's what the K.A.T. stands for and I would absolutely love it it is such a pretty ukulele and I my favorite ukulele size I have I just moved my favorite ukulele size I have is a concert because it isn't too big it's not too small and I think I would like one a tiny bit bigger but I still will play my other ukuleles I still play them all but I just I like collecting them and I would like to have a collection one day so I think that that is definitely the thing I want more than anything else so the next thing are kind of gift sets so I would love anything soap and glory like the soap and glory gift set um, but yeah, I love Soap and Glory, so like Soap and Glory gift sets. If it's got like honey, shellac, beeswax, things like that, I don't, I couldn't have that because I am vegan and I don't like to use products that aren't vegan. Pretty sure there's a list of what is vegan, but a lot of the gift sets that you can get from Soap and Glory are vegan anyways. And then the next thing is Lush or Lush gift sets. I don't mind if they're gift sets or just normal. I just love Lush so much. And again, obviously vegan because I'm vegan. I absolutely love the Christmas range which will be out on the 1st of October so near my birthday it will be available and maybe like the Snow Fairy gift set or one of the Christmas gift sets or like a Christmas bath bomb. I absolutely love the Lush Christmas range. And then I've got a list of vouchers that I would like so um, my family members often my family members often ask me what vouchers I like so I've put vouchers in here as well. And the vouchers I like are Boots, John Lewis and Debenham. The next thing on my list is scrunchies. I absolutely love scrunchies. I do have a few. I just have this box which is full to the, which is full to the brim of scrunchies. And I would just like a few more. And the like pink, grey, floral ones, yellow pastel yellow pastel purple things like that so then for clothes i have two brands that i really like minga london and breath of young breath of young you can find them on instagram i'm pretty sure they're breath of youth clothing or something i can't remember but i will put their instagram profile on the screen and basically anything from any of those brands are my style minga london i'm a bit more specific of what i like from there but pretty much anything i would wear and then breath of young literally if you get me anything from the website i would love anything and I would wear everything like that whole shop 
that whole shop. I wish that could be my wardrobe. And the final thing on my list is an advent calendar, um, like the makeup ones or the vegan chocolate one or things like that. I absolutely love advent calendars, especially the beauty ones or like the body shop ones, stuff like that. So I really hope you found this video useful and maybe gave you ideas of what to get other people or what you might want to ask for yourself because I had to watch a few of these videos to get inspiration for myself. But I really hope you enjoyed this video. I love you all and I will see you in my next video.